let's talk about that because was uh, obviously Venice was the the mecca. It is still to this day the Macho Mecca. I mean, that's kind of what our name is based on. So, was everyone training with Joe Gold at Gold's Gym back then, or and you know, was that the goal? No, what happened when I went there, Joe Gold was a little bitty place, very very little back in the late '60s. Right. Then Joe Joe Gold sold it to Pete Gronkowski. Gotcha. When I went there, Pete Gronkowski was the owner. And that's when they started franchising Gold Gym. Where what Joe Gold's did in the contract, he could never open up anything that had the name Gold's to it. So he started World Gym. That's right, yep. That's right, he started World Gym. And our honor would come by and talk to us in the parking lot, but he would not step foot in Gold. He, the Lou Ferrigno and Charles Glass, all them guys worked at Gold, but honor worked out that used to go to, to World Gym to trade because he was very loyal to, uh, to Joe. Joe yeah. Gold. So he would never go to Gold Gym again after Joe sold uh, the first uh, one. Sold yeah, gym. gotcha. Yeah, yeah, he would never. Yeah, yeah, he would never go there again because you know he was just he had you know loyalty to uh, Joe Gold. Right. So the idea was Gold could not open up another uh, gym uh, using the name uh, Gold. Interesting. Yeah, that, that's that's cool history right there. So you.